Hi guys, welcome to the video on how to prepare for the Vinker uh, GDPI program. Fine, this video will give a complete, complete overview about what to study and how to study to crack the Vinker GDPI. So like every other B school, we Vinker hardly give you 15 days ka time to prepare. So we have around, uh, we normally get around 15 days time. So you have to convert the call in those, prepare in those 15 days. So we'll target, in this video, we'll target how to prepare in the last few days for Vinker. I'll give the important cases. I'll talk about the important question for the interview in this video. Yep. So be be with me for the next few minutes. Fine. All right. First thing first, let's start with what are your chances to convert. Now we will have a round one, round two. So round one includes the written test scores and your psychometric scores. So your written test scores and psychometric score combined is 200 marks. Fine. So now the main problem is when the student comes that I've got a very less score of 80 percentile, 85 percentile, will I convert, will incur or not. So let me, let's clarify that thing. Now written test weightage is 100 marks, yeah, out of the total. Fine, let's compare a person with 98 percentile who have no chance to convert a MMS in will incur. So only chance he have got is a PGDM. Fine, and one of the students have got 85. Let, let's take another worst example, 80 percentile. Now they are poles apart, percentile, 80 percentile have a very less chance and this guy, 98 will have a very strong chance to convert. But if I, the, this is a breakup out of 100 percentile and if I scale it down to 100 marks which is 25 percent weightage, 25 percent weightage, 1 4, the gap is 20 here, the gap reduced to 5 marks. So the gap between the topper and the last rank holder is only 5 percent marks which can easily be covered in a good interview, a good PI or good everything. Fine, a good PI, good psych good case study, good psychometric test. So everything can be leveled up. So don't worry, even if you have 80 percentile or a 99 percentile, all of you have got an equal chance. It all depends how you perform in the remaining stage. All right. All right, so let's imagine what's going to happen to you that day. You'll report the college in the morning and uh, where the registration will happen they will give you a ppt and all please make your notes out of the ppt normally the, the panelists will ask you the question any, if you have any questions you can ask any question on the ppt about the college events about the college professors and all so do make notes out of your ppt fine after the presentation overview you'll be divided into teams who will be going for your next rounds so next round is going to be there's going to be a case study fine so there will be a case given to you which you have to perform, which you have to talk about as a discussion in GD topic. Fine. Followed by will be a essay writing. You have to write about the same case, followed by your personal interview. This is the three rounds which are going to happen. Case study is 100 marks, so as important as your CET scores. You have spent one year, two years preparing for your CET, but you have not done too much in the case study, so you have to work for that. And PI is another 100 marks. Essay writing is 20 marks, so not a big deal at all. So a case study and PI are two most important factors which are going to which are going to decide your career. Alright. Alright, well, we start the first part which is a case study. What to do in the case study? A case study normally is basically a GD but more structured approach. Fine. For example, if I ask you, uh, if they give you a topic of disability, I'll give you a live case of V school. Disability, people with disability are not getting enough chances. So that's a GD topic. You can talk about anything. I can talk about women empowerment. I can talk about any damn thing on earth. I can also relate to disability after having a terrorist attack. So I can talk about the terrorist attacks as well. I can compare India's GDP, budget, everything to us. I can take, talk any nonsense at length. And that's what used to happen at Willinker and other places where the GD used to happen. Now, off lately, they have moved out of GD into a case study mode. Case study, you have to be specific. For example, there's a guy who have a disability. How will you help him to get the job? Or what a company should do to encourage more disabled people to apply to them? Fine. So that's a typical case which is going, you're going to get. It's a small three, four lines case in which you have to talk. So now Narsi Monji, KJ Sumaya and Willinker, all of them move to case study approach. Because that's more structured, that's more serious. That's better way to judge a person rather than talking non nonsense in a GD. Yep, let me give you another example of, of a case, HR case, employee want to resign, fine, and you are the HR manager, ma manager you have to stop him, so well, what steps you will take to stop him, fine, a student have returned a torn book, fine, in a library, so the librarian what action you should take, because the 
स्टूडेंट इज़ अ वेरी पुअर चैप वेरी नॉट फ्रॉम वेल टू डू फैमिली सो हाउ विल यू अप्रोच दैट पर्टिकुलर केस सो दिस आर ऑल द टिपिकल एग्जाम्पल्स यू आर गोइंग टू गेट वेन यू टॉक अबाउट द केस स्टडी या एंड यू हैव टू डिस्कस द केस Fine. So this is where C T King come into picture. That if you are joining us for C T King, fine. What we are going to do? We are going to make you draw the case as well. All my students were drawing fishbone diagrams and Potter's five force model in the G D. So that that will gain you more marks. So there is a structured approach, well made structured approach we use for a case study approach, which will help you perform well. Fine. And normally there are only six people in the G D. So this is very calm and quiet. So don't worry, you will get a chance to speak. Yep. All right. There are four kind of main essays. Number one, the HR case. HR case is the typical. The employee have resigned. How will you stop him? Then come the sales case. The sales are falling. We have a very good product, but sales are still fall, still falling. So how will you revive the sales? Fine. Strategy case is MNC want to extend into North India, South, South Indian, sorry, uh, foreign MNC want to come to India. Fine. So make their uh, entry strategy and all. Last is the generic case. Generic case is like the employee. We talked about earlier. How will you reduce the pop population of a city? How will uh, how will a la 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 librarian handle the case of a town book? So these can typical come under the general category. Fine. If you are seating students, solution is given for each of them in your dashboard. So please go through each of the cases and how to approach each of the cases with the diagrams. All right. All right. So this is my workshop. I normally conduct some workshops at Willingcar College. fine so um, next will be the essay writing so all of you will have to write the essay on the same case study fine so for the theory king student we are going to approach the same way fine paragraph 1 para 2 para 3 para 4 finish write down all the things we have uh, discussed after write from your problem statement to analysis solution and contingency plan and follow the same process which is there fine so essay writing again you have to write the essay so please it's a essay writing on case study not a generic essay writing so make sure you write it as a case not as a uh, generic essay all right finally will be a person interview a person interview is very very uh, dicey situation at willinker because they normally this year they doing a stress interview they are the moment you say i am want to do my mba in finance they'll ask you question marketing the moment you say mba marketing they they ask they ask you question on finance so be prepared for everything and anything on this earth fine the moment you don't know you can politely say no fine this they are intentionally putting under stress to check out how you perform under stress so don't worry at all willinker pi is doable is all right it's not very very is always is tough no doubt but don't worry you will be equally marked fine just don't lose your patience and confidence in the interview yep you will sail through all right so within pi these are the most important question 10 question on which your interview will revolve around starting from why introduction why mba why marketing finance hr your profile base technical question you have to prepare at least one subject from your college profile base mean regarding your work ex or your extra curricular at college hobbies interest strength and weakness goals in life idol in life current affairs last one month current affairs very very important i would recommend if you can buy business today and india today magazines business today is for all the business news for the last 15 days and india today is for all the current affairs so that will be more than sufficient if you are seating students answer for each of these question is given in their linear login id under gd by section so i want you to see all my videos and write down your answer and prepare for that because pi weightage is 25% so this is make or break thing for you yep All right. So people who scored less than ninety-eight percentile, Willinker PGDM is a very, very good chance. In fact, the only chance to convert in the top four B schools. Fine. So uh, what we are doing is we have started with these workshops. You can see the link on cetking.com online programs. Fine. And in case you want to talk to us, you can call us on nine five nine triple four one double four eight. Fine. And we'll help you out. So we have started this online program, which is. Which covers your interviews. We'll be taking interviews on the te telephonic interviews. With that includes answers for all the questions: why MBA, strength, weakness, hobbies, how to write essay, and how to approach the case study. So you can join the program online on cetking.com or call us on this number. All right. All the best. Thank you.